Hi, I'm Desmond P. Ryan, crime writer and retired police detective. And today we're going to talk about wounds, uh, specifically those that will end your life. And now we're talking my language, uh, professionally speaking, of course. Now, I'm reading a book. It's really well done. It talks about uh, the coroner deciding that the life-ending uh, injury was caused by a knife. Very easy to for the coroner to figure out. Uh, he gives an estimation of about the size of the blade. Totally cool, that works. Then he talks about what kind of knife it likely was. That became a bit of a problem because in this particular story, it's a flick knife, um, which suggests to me that there's gonna be little handles on the knife, but it doesn't explain uh, how the coroner would know this. And so the only way that he could say without any shadow of doubt is that there would be bruising around the injury that would be consistent with those little metal pieces on the handle. So if you're going to be very, very specific, as this book is because it's integral to the plot, about what kind of weapon your murderer used, make sure that the... A uh, coroner's decision about it fits with the weapon and that that decision makes sense. We will talk lots more about this. That's all I'm going to say today. Great question. Great answer, I think. Um, again, I'm Desmond P. Ryan. Feel free to add comments down below and send me your questions at des at realdesmondryan.com.